Well, 35 million Americans were on alert yesterday for severe weather. A storm system that brought widespread flooding to parts of Texas and the Gulf Coast is pushing east. Damaging winds and hail are all the biggest threat now, but David Daniel reports people in Mississippi and Louisiana are still dealing with Saturday's late night flash flood. Water rescues and road closures. For days, heavy rain has pounded the southeast, leaving residents in search of higher ground as floodwaters engulf their homes. We've already had 18 houses underwater, you know, that's had so much water in them a foot or above. So we've been really, really upset. Some parts of Louisiana saw several inches of rain fall overnight, leaving some roads impassable. Mississippians saw a similar sight. Flooded roads left people stranded in Biloxi. Residents called loved ones as they loaded into rescue boats on Sunday. First responders carried stranded residents and their pets to nearby shelters. Strong storms rocked Dauphin Island off the Alabama coast. Homeowners and vacationers surveyed the damage Sunday afternoon after fierce winds sent trees into homes and scattered debris across the island. And then our house starts shaking like we were in a boat. I mean, it was shaking and rocking yeah. back and forth. The Gulf will get a break from rain soon, forecasts show. But some residents worry any more rain could slow the recovery. Can't get through with one before you start another one. I'm David Daniel reporting.